Hi guys, um, so today I'm going to be doing an e.l.f. haul video for you guys with a review because I got the products about a month ago so I'm just going to do a short review on all the products that I got and I just want to say that um, this is not a professional review or anything like that it's just my personal um, preference or opinion after using the products. Okay, so let's get started. Um, first product I'm going to talk about is the e.l.f. Uh, Clarifying Press Powder and so I actually broke the lid. I've used it quite a lot. And um, it's in tone number one. And I just use it for touch-ups throughout the day. So um, it's a dollar and it works really good. I wouldn't use it as like your main um, face powder, but it works good for just throughout the day touch-ups. So yeah, that's that. And um, the second product is the e.l.f. Healthy Glow Bronzing Powder and it's in Luminance. Um, this product I didn't really like. Um, it's way too shimmery. I found that it, um, you can't really see the shimmer probably, but um, I found that it just like made my whole face look like glitter. So I don't recommend this product. Maybe if you like shimmer a lot, then you might want to try it, but that's that. Um, this is the e.l.f. Contouring Blush and Bronzing Powder, and this is in Blushed and Bronze, and this is from their studio line, so it's three dollars instead of a dollar. Um, so has a mirror. This is what the colors look like. Um, so that's the bronzer and then that's the blush. So they're really quite pigmented. Um, they're really quite shimmery as well so if you don't like shimmer I wouldn't recommend them. Um, and the only thing I have is that they're kind of not really buildable. So if you're going to put the blush on, make sure you just use a little bit because you can't um, tone it down once it's on there. It's really, really bright. So um, that's what I think about that. And next I'll talk about, this is the e.l.f. Waterproof Eyeliner Pen. So it looks like this. And this is kind of like a marker that's dying out. <laughs> um, it was a dollar, but it's just, it's not very dark, and um, so you're going to have to go over it like quite a few times, and like you're pulling on your eye kind of thing, so I don't really recommend this. Um, the next product is e.l.f. Wet Glass, or Gloss, sorry, Lash and Brow Clear Mascara. This is a really good product. It's a dollar, and it tames your brows, I've used this part a lot, and this is the clear mascara, but I use both because, I mean, they both do the same thing, right? So, you can use both sides for um, taming your brows, or if you just wanted to use it for the mascara side, you can do that. The next is, this is from the Studio line as well, and this is the e.l.f. Primer and Liner Seal. So what the primer looks like. It's really kind of like a um, a yellow tinge. It's too dark for my skin tone and it's the only color it comes in. So I wasn't really a fan of that. It does work. It's just, so maybe if you're a darker skin tone than I am, it might work. And this is what the seal looks like. And I never did use the seal. Kind of smells like nail polish remover a bit. So that's that. Next I'm going to talk about is um, eyeshadows. And this is actually one of their quad palettes. So it just looks like this. I forget how much this was. I think it's three or four dollars. So I have a mirror. And then the four. And I actually have three eyeshadows and a blush. So this is the blush and it's in glow. This is the highlight color, which is the light white color. And it's in ivory. And then the gold color is in um, Golden Glow. Golden Glow. Okay. And then this is black color is in Dusk. And these are really cute. You probably can't see it anymore, but they do have like an eye or a face, like the outline of a face on them, so you know if it's a blush or an eyeshadow. Um, and they're really pigmented. I really like them, especially that highlighter. Um, which is in ivory. 
So I really recommend those products. The blush is really good too. It works really good with my skin tone. Um, next, this is the e.l.f. Duo Eyeshadow Cream in Butter Pecan. And this is also from the Studio line. So it was $3. And this is what they look like. So if you use um, a really good base with these, because they are cream shadows, they will crease if you don't. So, um, yeah, if you're going to get any of those, they have different colors, like different duos, but I would definitely use a really good base. Um, the next two eyeshadows that I have, this is what I actually have on today, and this is, um, it's called Elf Brightening Eye Color, and it looks like this, and it's in silver lining, and it's a dollar. So really good um, product. I don't know if you guys can see but the colors are really pigmented and it's only a dollar and you can use these quads to create a whole look like I did. So highlighter, um, crease color, or sorry this is what I put on the outer third of the eye. This is the crease color, the darkest one, and then this is like the all over the lid color and on the inner corner. So I really would recommend these to you guys. They have different ones. I have one other one, and this is um, in Drama. I haven't used it yet, but again, colors are like really pigmented, and you can create um, a whole look out of it. So I'll just swatch this for you guys. Okay, so highlight, dark gray, black, and the lighter gray. Okay. Um, the next product is the ELF Shimmering Facial Whip, and I really like this product actually. It's good for a highlight. It's like this. They're a dollar. And I'm just going to rub it in a little bit better. You do have to kind of uh, rub them in a bit, but they do work really good. I'm a fan of those. They have different colors too. And um, then I also have these three, which are the all over color stick. And they're a dollar. These are my favorite e.l.f. products. They're so good. Okay, the first one is in persimmon. Looks like this. It's kind of like a tanny nudie color. Looks like that. These are great for um, bases. Um, or you can use them like all over or as like the highlight um, and then you can also use them on your cheeks or your lips. I don't use them on my lips but I have used them on my cheeks but mostly on the eye. This one is um, Pink Lemonade. This one is really good for a blush. It's super um, pigmented. So it's that second one, the dark pink one there. And then the one I use the most I would say is um, Lilac Petal. And it looks like that. That's the one I used as a base and a highlight today uh, on my eyes. So really recommend these. They're really good. And the last thing I'm going to talk about is um, there, some lip stuff. So this is e.l.f. Candy Shop Lip Gloss Cherry Bomb. It came free with my order. It does smell like cherries. Um, but I do find it's like really kind of like sticky. And I don't really like sticky lip glosses, so. But I mean, it's free, so. And the second thing is this Elf Therapeutic Conditioning Balm, and it's in blackberry cream. Just looks like this. These are super moisturizing, so for a dollar, I would really recommend these, and um, they're actually really, really moisturizing. So, look at that. It smells great. And the last thing is um, the e.l.f. Plumping Lip Glaze in Baby Doll. Lots of people have this. So I'll just show you. Um, okay, like what it looks like. I can smell the mint already. Um, and then the plumper is just this, the white kind of. So yeah, you put this on, the plumper on and then put the color over top and it plumps your lips. Um, it does work. It's pretty good for a dollar. I mean, um, you will notice the tingle. Like, it does tingle kind of your lips, that, like, uh, 
minty kind of thing. And it does have shimmer in it, the gloss. Um, so, I mean, there are better products out there, but for a um, dollar, can't really go wrong with that. And, okay, so that's it. I'm probably going to do a couple more videos today. Um, so, if you have any questions about any of the products or you want any tutorials, um, just leave a comment below. And please don't forget to um, subscribe and rate. Thanks. Bye.